so the next topic in your first module is line codes okay so basically what is meant by line codes line codes are used for data transmission of digital signal over a transmission line okay so they can be defined as the digital data can be represented by different formats or waveforms these waveforms are commonly known as digital data formats or their representation is called as line coding okay so basically there are mainly 1 2 3 4 5 6 seven types of line coding techniques okay so the main types of line coding techniques are you have the first one as unipolar first two comes under into this category unipolar can be again divided into two types unipolar non return to zero and unipolar return to zero next type is your polar so in in case of polar you have two types one is polar non return to zero and polar return to zero next you have bipolar bipolar also you have two types one is non return to zero and return to zero and the last one is called a split phase manchester okay so in this case you are going to represent your digital data so digital data you know that zero or one can be represented by different forms so in case of unipolar it is also called as o o k okay on off keying technique so if you have uh, if symbol one is present you have a pulse present if uh, if there is no signal you have it is zero okay for symbol zero it is zero so for the first case let us see unipolar non return to zero so if symbol one is transmitted what you will be getting x of t is equal to a for the entire time duration for zero to tb whereas for signal zero it is zero for uh, for your time duration zero to tb now what is the difference between non return to zero and return to zero lies in your time duration so this is for full duration whereas in the case of return to zero it is only for your half duration that is for zero to tb by two okay so if symbol one is transmitted again you have the same case for uh, your value is x of t is equal to a for zero to t less than or equal to tb by two whereas for next half that is tb by two to tb your value will be equal to zero for symbol zero you have the value as zero no pulse right so zero for your entire time duration zero to tb so that is your first two types unipolar non return to zero and unipolar return to zero whereas in the case of polar non return to zero and polar return to zero or you will be uh, getting pulses positive as well as negative pulses for symbol one it will be a and for symbol zero it will be minus a whereas in this case for symbol zero it was zero okay so what will be your non return to zero your time for the entire time duration your x of if symbol one is transmitted x of t will be equal to a for zero to tb for, as well as if symbol zero is transmitted it will be minus a for zero to tb now if you take tb half duration it becomes return to zero right polar return to zero if symbol one is transmitted x of t will be equal to plus a for the half duration and for another half that is tb by 2 to tb it will be equal to zero similarly for the next zero is transmitted x of t is equal to minus a okay so positive and negative pulse minus a for the half duration 0 to tb by 2 and for another half tb by 2 to tb the value is equal to 0 so this is the two categorization of your polar return to 0 and non return to 0 next one is your bipolar non return to 0 so this bipolar non return to 0 is also called by another name alternate mark inversion it is called as ami okay alternate mark inversion alternatively it switches off to positive pulse and negative pulse that is if you have consecutive ones okay if you have consecutive ones then the pulses with alternate polarity will be present so first one will get positive pulse second next one will get negative pulse that is how it goes on whereas zero means if symbol zero is transmitted there is absence of pulse or no pulse is present so this is in the case of non return to zero this is zero non return to zero means for the entire duration zero to tb what will be your bipolar return to zero same concept if symbol one is transmitted the alternate pulses uh, will be there only for half duration zero to tb by two for another half it will be equal to zero for pulse zero there is no pulse if symbol zero is transmitted there is absence of pulse okay now the last one is called a split phase manchester so what is meant by split phase manchester if your symbol one is transmitted it has two phases that is 
a and minus a x of t is equal to a for 0 to tb by 2 and minus a for tb by 2 to tb whereas if symbol 0 is transmitted it is uh, opposite that is minus a for 0 to tb by 2 and plus a for tb by 2 to tb okay so this is the split phase manchester so let us see the example one of the example okay so let me take your binary data as 1 0 1 1 0 1 0 so now we are going to categorize all the different types. So first one is unipolar non return to 0. So what is unipolar non return to 0? If 1 is transmitted it is A. If 0 is there is no pulse. Okay A and 0. For 1 it is pulse is there. For uh, 0 it is 0. Okay so this is for 1 and this is for 0. So see here for 1 you have for the entire time duration you have the pulse. That is the amplitude is taken as A. Okay. So for 0, no pulse. It is 0. Okay. Again, for 1, you have it is A. For 0, it is 0. 1, it is A. Okay. What is unipolar return to 0? Here it was full half dura full duration. Here it is half duration. Tb by 2. Only for 0 to Tb by 2, your value will be equal to A. For 0, there is no pulse. Similarly, here it is 1. So for 0 to Tb by 2, half duration, you will be having the pulse present here also another half it will go to zero so here also you have one during half duration tb by two you have the value as a for zero zero so here for one you have for half duration tb by two you have your pulse present okay now what is polar not return to zero polar means you have a and minus a one uh, sorry one means a and zero means it is minus a right and for the entire duration so here it is one means you have a 0 means it is minus a here it is both it is 1 so you have plus a here it is minus a plus a 0 okay for return to 0 means this tb you have here tb by 2 so this will be equal to tb by 2 for for half duration you have the positive pulse a remaining half you have 0 here the transmitted symbol is 0 so you have minus a for how much tb by 2 similarly here it is 1 so half duration tb by 2 here also it is tb by 2 here it is 0 it is minus a so 1 it is plus a for tb by 2 okay and the next one is called as called as bipolar non return to 0 so bipolar means alternate a's right so first for as for first one it will be plus a for second one it will be minus a for the entire duration non return to zero that is what it is written here okay x of t is equal to pulse is present for the entire duration and it is alternative so see here in this case your first one you have positive a next next it is zero so zero for zero it is zero no pulse is present for next one you have here it was previously it was plus a so here you have minus a okay so next one you have it is plus a zero it is zero Next one you have it is minus a because in the previous it was plus a it goes on. For return to zero what will be happening instead of tb here you are taking half duration that is tb by 2. So first one it will be plus a for half duration it is 0. For the next one it is minus a so here it will be equal to minus a right since there is no space I have cut short like this. Okay so this is how you have to draw. Okay. So here again for the next one it will be minus a for half duration. Remaining half duration it will be 0. Next also it is 1. So here it is minus a. Next it is plus a. Okay. For 0 it is 0. Next it is for the next one it will be minus a. It goes on. The last one is called a split Manchester. In split Manchester what is happening? You have 1 means a to minus a and 0 means minus a to a. Okay, that is what a to minus a and for 0 means it is minus a to a. So, for example, for the first data is your 1, right? For 1 it is for 0 to tb by 2 it will be plus a, tb by 2 to tb it will be minus a. Okay, now the next data is 0. 0 means it will be minus a to a. Similarly, next it is 1. So, a to a. Next also it is 1. So, it is a to a. Next it is 0 minus a to a. Next it is 1 a to minus a. Next it is 0 so minus a to a. So this is how you have to give an example uh, 
you have to give example as well as the ex explanation if it is asked as an all. So the half of the first module is uh, over. So the notes will be available in my telegram channel. Next videos we will see the next half and uh, the problems with university questions.